Hello guys, welcome to TV class. I'm your teacher today, Mr. Joel Bacalares. Kayo ba ay may mga gamit na di kuryente sa bahay? Alam niyo ba na ang mga electrical gadget natin sa bahay ay madali lang gawin? Production of Simple Gadgets Sa raling ito ay papakita ko sa inyo kung paano gumawa ng isang extension cord. An extension cord is an electrical gadget that is longer than an ordinary cord. It has a nail plug at one end and a receptacle at the other. It is used to accommodate extra electrical devices needing electric supply. Ang pinakauna natin gawin ay ating ihanda ang mga gamitan na ating gagamitin sa paggawa ng isang extension cord. Extension cord tools and materials. Mail plug, flat cord, stranded wire number 16, receptacle outlet. Also prepare Phillips screw, side cutter, and wire. Mga bata, dapat ninyong bandaan na ang mga tools na ito ay may kanya-kanyang gamit. Electrical tools and their functions. Phillips screw has a cross tip resembling a positive sign. This is used to drive screws with cross slot heads. Sign cutter is used for cutting fine, medium, and big wires and cables. Pliers are made from metal with insulators in the handle and are used for cutting, twisting, bending, holding, and gripping wires and cables. Other electrical tools are Allen screwdriver, electrician's knife, hammers, portable electric drill, hacksaw, wire stripper, and many others. Steps in making an extension cord Prepare the tools and materials that you need for the project. Get the flat cord wire. Cut 2 inches from the end of each wire and remove the outer covering or insulator of the wire to show the copper wire. Use pliers to remove the outer covering of the wire. the receptacle outlet. Loosen the screw with its terminal of the receptacle, then attach the copper wire to positive and negative terminal of the receptacle. Use screwdriver to loosen and fasten each terminal. Get the mail plug. Loosen the cover of the plug and attach the other side of the wire to positive and negative terminal. Use screwdriver to loosen and fasten each terminal. Double check if the wire is fully attached to the terminal of receptacle and plug. Make sure that there are no loose copper wire that may cause short circuit both in the receptacle and the plug. 
Cover and fasten the screw of the receptacle and plug carefully. Dapat nating tandaan mga bata, kung tayo ay may gagawin na may kinalaman ang kuryente, dapat doblihin natin ang ating pag-iingat. Safety rules to follow. Avoid running around to prevent sleeping, falling, or bumping into others who are working with sharp tools. Always wear goggles for your eye safety while working. Use clamp or pliers in handling hot objects. Ask help if you do not know how to use the machine or simple gadgets. If accident happens, call or report to proper authority. Avoid octopus and overloading connection to prevent fire. Put all electrical cords away from wet surface. Turn off electrical gadgets and equipment when not in use. Unplug the cord from an outlet properly. Work in a well-ventilated area. Always use appropriate safety footwear and gloves when using electrical tools. Keep away cords from heat, soil, and sharp edges. Bago natin tapusin ang araling ito, ay subukan muna natin nasagutin ang aking munting pagsusulit. Name the two in the picture. Choose your answer from the list. Half saw, Phillips screw, Allen screwdriver, side cutter, liar. At syempre, meron akong pabaong takdang aralin para sa inyo. List at least three electrical gadgets that you find at home or in your area. Enumerate their corresponding functions as shown in the table below. Electrical gadget and functions. For example, electrical gadget, lamp shade. Functions to protect the eye from the bulb's glare and to direct light from the bulb in the lamp into the room. Sana ay may natukunan na At dito nagtatapos ang ating aralin tungkol sa production of simple gadgets. Ako si Teacher Joel, nagsasabing, mag-aral ang mabuti upang ang buhay ay buhay.